Another big MSM Girls Conference game in Springfield on Monday night. The undefeated Tri-City Tornadoes fresh off their Sagamon County Tournament Championship win, taking on the Lutheran High Crusaders, who took third at County and have the reputation of playing with some of the better teams in 1 and 2A this season. Lutheran High's game plan early was to get out and run as fast as they could. Off the rebound, Maddie Egg gets it ahead to Katie Elmore. We know she can score, and Lou High ties things up at 2. The defensive game plan for Lutheran was to double-team Tri-City's Ashley Ford inside, so the other girls had to step up and knock down shots. That included junior Aubrey Hunt, who steps behind the arc, minds up a three ball to give the Tornadoes an early lead. Off of any miss or any turnover, Lutheran High was out running. Elizabeth Bruner gets it out in open space for Maddie Eck. She goes hard to the rack and gets the easy two. When they had the opportunity, the Tornadoes showed that they can play the quick game as well. Freshman guard Ashlyn Sturdy drives into the lane, puts it up. It's no good, but Aubrey Hunt is there to clean it up. And Tri-City had a 15-8 lead over Lutheran High after one. Second quarter, more transition for the Crusaders. Tessa Workman, bringing the ball up, finds Katie Elmore again. Left-handed finish for two. The Tornadoes found themselves open on the perimeter as Ashley Ford was getting double and triple teamed inside, but when you're that size, sometimes it doesn't matter. Off the hunt miss three, Ford grabs the board and scores to make it 17 to 10. Lou High continued to try and speed this one up though. Tori Hollenshed grabs the board and flings it ahead for Elmore, who flies by defenders for the finish and transition as Lou High trimmed the lead all the way down to one halfway through the second quarter. The Crusaders stuck to that same defense that held Ford to just five first half points, but her supporting cast stepped up. Ashley Sturdy steps into the three ball, put the Tornadoes lead back up to seven late in the second. Alou High would keep them within striking distance. Katie Elmore again, this time for three. She had 13 in the first half, and Tri-City's lead at the break was just 25 to 21. Whatever momentum Lou High had at the half, stayed in the locker room. Ashlyn Sturdy drives in the lane and scores to pad Tri-City's lead. Sturdy had 12 points on the night as one of three tornadoes in double figures. Tri-City would try to get the ball to Ford a little more in the second half. Jesse Benson feeds Ford, who rises above the double team and scores to make it an 11 point game. The Tornado defense would hold Lutheran High to zero points in the third quarter as Tri-City pulled away in this one. Ford gets the ball inside and kicks it back out to Grace Honeyman, who knocks down the triple. Tri-City led 34 to 21 after three quarters. Blue High would finally score in the fourth quarter, but their defense couldn't stop the Tornadoes. Aubrey Hunt gets it on the block and goes up strong. She finished with the game high 18 points to push the Tornado lead out to 17. And then to close it out, good ball movement allows the Tornadoes to find Ford inside again. She had 12 points and Tri-City beat Lutheran High 44 to 31 to stay undefeated on the season. Talked about coming out with intensity. We knew they took a shot in the mouth in the first half and uh, we knew we were going to score. We knew we were going to move the ball and we were going to get some shots up and uh, luckily our defense came to play in the second half. You guys have won three tournaments. You've taken everyone's best shot. I mean, can this team run the table? I don't know. It's going to be tough. You know, I'd like to think we can. Uh, we got some big games coming up. We got uh, Pulaski coming up, and at the end of the year, we got a rematch with Athens at their or, at their court. And uh, I know they're going to be coming wanting for revenge. Uh, but it's exciting, man. I'm enjoying every moment of it.